all right guys uh, the first topic i am covering is simple microscope okay so you all know that simple microscope we sing, uh, use a convex lens in front of the eye and we keep the object either between the focus and the pole of the lens or we put it on the focus of the lens okay so these are the two cases in which there will be a magnified image uh, formed behind the lens okay so the first case is we call magnification as md when the image is formed at a distance d this distance is the distance of least distinctive vision okay so the least distance at which our eye can see clearly is 25 cm so the first case scenario is that if we place the object between the focus and the lens itself the magnification can be calculated using the formula v by u now i want you to learn that this v by u we can convert this into f minus v by f using these two formula they are just another form of lens formula that is 1 by v minus 1 by u equals to 1 by f we can convert this to get v equals to f u upon f plus u and u equals to f v upon f minus v okay so if you understand both of them then look here magnification md will be equals to v by u and I, if i replace u as f v upon f minus v we get f minus v by f and now in place of v i will put minus d because the image is forming behind the lens at a distance of capital d while substituting this i get my first formula that is magnification md equals to 1 plus d by fe you will have to remember this one because we will be using uh, this convex lens as our eyepiece that is why in case uh, in place of f i have written fe because this lens we will be using this as our eyepiece okay in uh, both compound microscope and compound telescope will be using this formula okay so remember this one the second case is m infinite m infinite is when the final image is formed at infinity if the image forms at infinity it means that the object is placed on the focus of the lens like this okay in this case the image will be formed at infinity you can see that the one ray will pass through the focus the other will pass undeviated the final image will be huge and it will be at infinite uh, at uh, v equals to infinity we cannot calculate the magnification using the basic formula v by u because v tends to go infinite so we use another technique we calculate magnification using the angle subtended by the image upon the angle subtended by the object got it so beta here we can look at this triangle and get it that beta can be written as this height divided by this length using 10 beta formula well beta is supposedly a very small angle so beta equals to h by fe similarly alpha is when i put the object here and try to look at it directly through my eye when i try to do that i have to put the object at least d distance away because i cannot look anything clearly if it is less than 25 cm close to my eye so alpha will be given by h by d now i have both the alpha and the beta when i put them here i get magnification m infinity as d by fe this is also the formula for eyepiece when the final image is at infinity remember this magnification is also called normal magnification because our eye can look clearly very easily at something placed at infinity okay we will use both these two formula in compound microscope and telescope 